Hi, in this video we're going to take a look at Flipbook's Cut, Copy, and Paste feature. For starters, we're going to click on the Select tool. If you click and hold on the Select tool, there is a Lasso option um, and a couple other options that we'll go into in some other video. But for now we're going to stick with the rectangle and we're just going to drag a box around the part of the area that we want to work on. And now to pick it up, we're just going to cut it and then paste it back into the image. So you can see the blue highlight there lets you know that it's pasted back in. And right now it's just floating above the cell. We can do whatever we want with it. Okay, we can just click in here and drag it. So if we just want to move it a little bit, we can do that. We can click on a corner and scale it in case we want to change the size. We can even squash it and stretch it, all right, to do whatever we want to do with this thing. One more feature, if you hold down the control key, you can actually rotate it, all right? And if you don't like the results of what you got, you can hit escape and it'll go back. And if you hit escape again, it'll disappear. Now you can just hit paste and the original is right back there again. So you've got a chance to do it over, all right? So let's just scale this one down a little bit, maybe move it a little bit. When we've got it where we want it, we just click outside the box and then it's pasted right in there and that's the way our cell looks now. So if we move away to a different cell, which saves this one, we can see that the thumbnail is updated when we come back to it, we can see that it's right where we put it. So that's Flipbook's cut, copy, and paste feature for editing cells.